Hello, what's up? What's happening, ladies and gentlemen? Today, we're ranked number two in the nation, taking on number 22, Penn State, man. Last year, we finished the year ranked number two. We should have been in the national championship game, but they put number three, LSU, in versus Michigan. Michigan got the job done. We were in the Rose Bowl taking on number four, Georgia. It was a fantastic game. We got the job done there, and now we're looking to take that next step to be crown the champions of the college football landscape that's what we want this year so we cannot have any mistakes our first three games of the season not that easy we got of course penn state today we got tennessee in our next game and then louisville the best thing about it is though penn state is at home obviously and tennessee is gonna be here in california which is a good look jones is now a red shirt senior red shirt junior excuse me he should be a senior could be a senior but he is a red shirt junior so he could come back next year too he's been a starter ever since his red shirt freshman days so we've seen some guys blossom we got d jacks on the return from the 10 yard line makes the man miss at the 20 full speed down to the 33 yard line move those chains and now it's going to be the harper show he replaces marshawn lynch in the backfield and the sophomore from oakland california is going to pick up a gain of nine give it to number 19 again breaks the tackle and he's loose shaw tried to bring him down he couldn't do it and there goes harper brought down by the face mask and this cow team looks scary we have a senior quarterback here is fisher his first pass to d jacks will be overthrown Deshaun Jackson is now a junior. He's been a major focal point in our offense ever since he stepped on campus as our third receiver way back in the day. Third down and five. Going to throw it to him, and this time he can't make the catch. So we will have to settle for a field goal, and the kick is up, but we miss it. The wind was whipping out there around 33 miles per hour going in the opposite direction, and that's why we missed it because my accuracy this time wasn't that bad. We send a blitz. We can't quite get the stover, but that pass going to be intercepted by Buck Ramirez, 40, 35, and brought down at the 30-yard line. So a great play by our defense. We could have easily had a sack. Instead, they throw a pick, and we'll take that. Going to fire this one over the middle, caught by Jackson. And we have a fresh set of downs at the 10 yard and make it inside the 10. So first and go from the 9 yard and give it to Harper. Touchdown number one. Could he win the Heisman? Marshawn, he, yo, he left with two in his back pocket. Rushed for over 2,000 yards in back-to-back -back seasons. Our rushing attack is absolutely phenomenal. Stover going to give this one up the gut to Adam Jenkins. And Adam Jenkins, he's going to pick up a gain of around one. Make it two. Third down, eight yards to go. They fake the run. Stover has it. Throw, Stover going to throw it to Nelson. That pass is caught. We were looking for the user, but we gets no love. So first down and ten. Toss for now to Thompson. And look out. Chris Jones laying the lumber. Loss of six on the play. Stover throws over the middle. Caught by Derek Williams. And he's going to work his way upfield for a nice game. Setting up third down and short. So third and five. They give it to Thompson. And Thompson will pick up the first down. So Austin Thompson, he's going to weave through traffic. And now Penn State set up with a fresh set of 10. And then Evans gets to the running back in the backfield. And they're going to lose seven on that last play. Going to throw this one to the outside. Caught. Evans on the coverage, and that's going to get him past the original line of scrimmage. So third down, nine yards to go. Stover has it. Stover throws it right over the head of Evans into the hands of Mr. Justin Nelson. They're tied in, and that's going to be a first down for the Nittany Lions. They run the ball with Austin Thompson, and he's going to get boxed up and boxed in. Lucas with the stop there. Second down and 10. Play fake. No, they actually do give it to Jenkins right up the gut. And Adam Jenkins, the big fullback, going to rumble for a decent game. Third down to four. Direct snap to Thompson. Brought down by Andrew Billings. True freshman inside linebacker who gets the start here. He's replacing Tyrone Demps. And that kick is no good. So they drive down the field. And just like us, they have some kicking issues. So we're up by seven. Going to run the ball with Harper. Harper makes a man miss, and then he gets brought down from behind. Five carries, 66 yards, plus a touchy. We're going to run the ball with Harper, and then he's going to pick up a first down. And the way we can run the ball, I think the whole country might be in trouble. That pass going to be caught by Cody Parks, wearing number 10. Obviously, he wore 81 last year, but now he rocks that Marshawn number 10. We're going to take a shot deep. That pass going to be caught by Jacobs, and that will be a first down. Move those chains. Fisher going to roll left. 
Fisher looking for Pat Sims and the tight end coming through with his first reception of the season. And it's going to be a big time gain as we work our way up to the 13 yard line. Give it to Harper again. Weaving through traffic brought down by Shaw. And we have it at the five yard line in the first quarter. So second down, two yards to go. Going to give it to Harper again. Spun forward. And that should be enough to move the chains in this. So first and goal from the two. In the round of D-Jax. Breaks a tackle. And he's going to take it to the crib. Touchdown, Golden Bears. So 14-0 is now the score. Derek Williams on the kick return. Gets brought down by Pratt. And now it's going to be first down and 10 from inside their own 20. And there goes our man Chris Jones. Another TFL today is second in the ballgame. They're going to run the ball with Thompson. He's going to get brought down by Hanson, who is now our number one deep tackle. Fletcher's number two. He did start his sophomore year talking about Fletcher. They take a shot deep here. That pass well defended by Carter. Now, again, Fletcher had playing time last year, but he was the backup last year. But now he gets playing time alongside Hanson on that D-line. Fisher looking downfield, sets his feet, throws it deep, looking for D-Jax, and that pass will be broken up. We had Cody Parks open. We went to the number one receiver, though, and it's not going to work out in our favor. That pass going to go nowhere as Kane. The newest starter on our D-line. He gets some pressure there. Going to throw this one deep. It's over that pass. Well defended by Ramirez. So now they've got to punt this one away. We take over. First down and 10. Going to give it to Harper. Another good job blocking up front. And we have ourselves a gain of six. Second down and four. Looking downfield for Pat Sims. Another catch for a big tight end. And that's going to result in a first down. Coming out of the gun, tied into the right three receivers to the left. Going to throw it to Cody Parks. Gain of around three. Our man Kevin Fisher, six of ten for 77 yards. Fisher going to roll right. Still rolling. Still rolling. Finally throws it, and that pass will be broken up. So now it's going to be third down and seven from the 44-yard line. Three receivers, one tied in out there. Going to throw it to D. Jackson, who was lined up in the slot. And he's trouble in the slot. He's trouble on the outside. Put him wherever you want to put him. He's going to be a monster out there. Going to throw this one underneath. Caught by Cody Parks again. It's going to be a gain of around possibly three yards again. Make it four. So second down and six from the 29-yard line. Fisher under pressure. And both tackles got beat. It's going to be Fred Holmes with the sack. And when you got two freshmen out there, right tackle and left tackle, you're going to give up some quick pressures from time to time. But for the most part, it's been good protection, just like it is on this play. We find Deshaun Jackson, and that's going to be another touchdown for the Golden Bears. We're up 21 to nothing. Verse number 22, Penn State. So first down, intending to hand that thing off to Austin Thompson. He's going to get brought down by Fletcher, and they're going to call a timeout. They have two left, minute of four in the clock, Stover on the design, quarterback keeper. And there goes Chris Jones, tackle number four for an outside backer. Third down and four now, they're going to come at us straight up the go. We had five D linemen, but they're able to run the ball right through the teeth of the defense. And they pick up a first down, so front of 39 now. Stover throws that thing, that pass caught by Jenkins. And the fullback makes the catch, but he goes straight out of bounds. They're going to throw it to the right side, caught by Nelson. And he goes straight out of bounds, brought down by Robinson. Third down, seven yards to go. Stover drops back, throws it over the middle, and that pass nearly intercepted. It's going to fall incomplete, and we're going to head to the second half of play. We're up by 21, but Penn State does get the ball first. Let's see what they can do. Now, so far this game, as Sanders takes a knee, they have less than 100 yards of total offense. That one turnover doesn't help either. So we're up by three scores. We just got to play solid defense and continue to move the ball on offense. This game will be ours. There goes Thompson weaving through traffic. Brought down by Lucas. Nice run there of 12 yards in the first down. Stover to the right side. That pass is caught. Little wide receiver screen. Billings is there for the stop. And now they're going to be looking at second down and six. I formation. Play fake. Stover to the flat. Caught by Jenkins. Brought down by Mr. Jones' His fifth stop today. Third down and seven. Stover. Going to slide right, throws it over the middle, broken up by Billings, and we're going to take over. So the defense answers the call, and now it's time to maybe start to work on this clock a little bit. Going to hand that ball off to Harper, gain of around nine for the sophomore, make it 10 yards in the fresh set of 10. From the 44, looking downfield for d and that pass is well defended. And now we're going to have a second down and 10 and go back to the air. That's Thomas, and Thomas is loose. Red shirt. 
freshman gets his first carry of his career. It's going to be a good one. Him and Harper came in the same recruiting class. Harper to the left side. Harper has the first down and gets brought down out of bounds at the 15-yard line. So we're doing what we want to do. We want to run the ball. We can run it. We want to pass it. We can pass. Going to pass it here. Throwing it to Cody Parks. Intercepted by Justin Shaw. So that's going to be his second interception of his career. The first one of the new season. And could this be the spark that Penn State needs? Now, obviously, we got to do a better job protecting the football, especially when we get in the red zone. Wide receiver screen. And Graves is there for the tackle. Second down and 12. Stover fires it. That pass caught. But Evans is there for the takedown. And now they're looking at third down and 12. Got to go downfield now. Stover going to throw this one deep to Nelson. Double coverage. And he hauls it in. Trying to make a play on the football, but we didn't at all. Go straight to the tide in a perfect spiral, and they have themselves in Cal territory. Going to fire this one deep caught by Derek Williams. Move those chains. First down, Penn State from the 18 yard line. Going to run that thing with Thompson. Thompson brought down by Evans. And now they're going to be looking at second down and seven. They're going to run it with Thompson again. Breaks the tackle, and he's brought down by Fletcher. But he will have a first down. So first and goal. Stover throws it to the end zone. That pass broken up by Robinson as they try to find the fullback in the end zone. They give it to him up that gut in the fullback. Adam Jenkins goes right up the middle for a touchdown. And the PAT would be missed. Again, the win is whipping out there. And now we're going to take over. Jacobs from inside his own five works the football up to the 20-yard line. First down and 10. 21 to 6 is now the score. We're going to open up the new possession with a pass play that's going to be broken up. So it's now second down and 10. We get the ball to Harper, and Harper is loose. Harper breaks a tackle, and the blocking was good. He found the hole. He finishes the run with a good stiff arm, and we have ourselves a first down with a gain of 10. Going to run that ball with Thomas, and Thomas is going to get brought down after a gain of 3 up to the 33-yard line. Fisher throws it. Broken up. We try to find Cody Parks. And now it's going to be third down and seven. Fisher looking downfield. Going to throw it to Pat Sims. Tight coverage. And they throw a flag for pass interference. The coverage was a little bit too tight. We're going to run that thing with Thomas. And Thomas is going to get brought down. And now we're looking at a second down and 13 situation. Going to go downfield to D. Jackson. He makes the catch. There's about five Nittany lines in the territory. But they couldn't make the play. And now we have it in Nittany Line territory. We're going to throw this one downfield. Just going to have to throw that thing away. Tried to make a play downfield. Nobody got open, so throw it away. Little to play another down. Get that thing to Harper. Going to turn the corner, and he gets tattooed on that one. Penn State's no for having a good linebacking corner. They show it off right there. Going to throw this one downfield yet again, and d Jacks is on a whole nother level. He was making plays his freshman year, sophomore year. You best believe he's going to make plays here in his junior year. And Sean Jacobs... Makes the catch, but it's holding on the play, so bring it all the way back. Going on the ball with Thomas. Thomas to the 20. Thomas out of bounds at around the 17-yard line. Third down now. Play fake. Looking downfield. That pass caught by Jacobs. Touchdown, Cal Bears. And we are now up 28-6. to So a 22-point lead as we head to the fourth quarter of play. So Derek Williams... From inside his own five up to the 10 to the 15 and gets brought down at around the 17 yard line. It's going to be first down and 10 from there. I formation. They fake it to the fullback. They throw it downfield. Caught. It's going to be a chain of move versus Penn State. They got to move the football downfield quickly. They're obviously a run first team as that pass is nearly intercepted by Evans. But Stover is going to have to get hot. They're going to run the ball over with the fullback. And again, they are a run first team. But at this stage in the ball game, you got to put this thing up in the air. Fletcher records tackle number three. Two TFLs today. They're going to fire that thing to the flat caught by Robertson. And again, that's just not going to get the job done. So 12 personnel out there for us. We're going to run the ball Harper. And Harper will have a chain mover. 15 carries approaching 150 yards today. Harper up the gut. Another big hit. Again, the Penn State linebackers know how to deliver the boom. Second down and seven. I formation. Going to run the ball with D-Jax on the end around. Breaks a tackle, but couldn't get away from the second defender. And now we're looking at third down and five. And on third and five, quick pass to Cody Parks. Again, this time last year, I'm not quite sure he makes that catch on third down, but the sophomore comes through here. Going to throw it to Cody Parks again. Makes the catch again, and that's going to result in a 
gain of eight. Second down and two now. Quick pass going right back to Cody Parks. And this time, that pass will hit the grass. So third down and two. We're going to run the ball with Thomas. Thomas to the 20. Thomas to the 10. Thomas to the five before he's caught by the shoelace. So first and goal, we're going to give it to Thomas again, brought down from behind. And now we're going to be looking at second down and goal. Going to throw it to D-Jax in the middle of the end zone. Touchdown, Cal Bears. And this 35-6, to six, and this thing should be over as Williams finds a lane and works his way up past the 30-yard line. So first down and 10 from the 33. Thomas going to get the carry, and he gets brought down by Chris Jones, but it is a face mask. So it will be a first down for the Nittany Lions up to the 48 yard line to get the ball to Thompson. And Thompson is brought down by Andrew Billings. The freshman has his fourth tackle. They go up the gut. Fletcher and company is there for the stop. His fourth stop as well. Third down and nine. Stover surveys the field. Throws it! And he throws off his back foot right into the hands of Chris Jones. And there you go. That should definitely seal this thing up. It was Kane that got the pressure, forced a bad pass. Jones jumps on top of it. Now he run the ball back-to-back -back times with Harper, and he will have a first down, move those chains. So 18 carries for the sophomore. Now we give it to Robinson, the big fullback, and let him rumble. And Robinson's going to pick up a game of around four. Going to give it to Harper again. Gets brought down around the line of scrimmage. And now it's going to be third down and five yards to go for the 21. Give it to Thomas. And Thomas makes the man miss in the secondary. And that is going to do it. 41, excuse me, 42 to 6 is the final. And we win game number one. Again, our schedule before Pac-10 play is awfully difficult. We have, not only do we have, uh, Penn State, obviously, but then we got Tennessee and Louisville. All three teams are ranked in the top 25. Now, although Penn State is ranked in the top 25, I did not think that we would lose this game, but I was pleasantly surprised to see the way that our O-line held up. Just one sack given up, and it was that one play where both tackles got beat. Again, that happens. When you have two freshmen starting, it can happen, but having a senior quarterback definitely helps with that. So, we played well. We got the job done. We're moving on to Tennessee. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I do hope that the rest of the day is the best of the day. Tune me to get my friends. Peace, love. Hot sauce.